Meghan Markle might lose interest in Prince Harry if he doesn't take steps to save their marriage, especially if he loses his royal status and title. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex, who tied the knot in 2018 and have two children, have faced challenges since they stepped back from their royal duties in 2020. The couple, now living in Montecito, California, have attempted to establish a profitable brand in the U.S. with partnerships with companies like Netflix and Spotify. However, it seems they are struggling to maintain American interests. Royal expert Tom Quinn has suggested that losing their royal status could harm or damage brands Sussex, and might lead to Meghan losing interest in Harry. He told the Daily Mirror, Harry and Meghan are beginning to worry that if their children don't have a relationship with the UK and by extension with the royal family they will damage brand Sussex. Surveys already show that America is losing interest in the couple and they both know that Harry's only real selling point, his only real brand value, is that H is a royal so he knows H is going to have to build bridges with the working royals or America will lose interest in him and if America loses interest there is a chance Meghan may also lose interest in him. Quinn added, being a royal is the only thing H has been trained to do, so he needs to maintain some kind of connection with his family in order to maintain his credibility as a royal. The previous month was quite turbulent for the pair, especially when Harry lost in his legal battle against the UK Home Office. He was trying to get a reverse decision that downgraded his security status since he ceased being a working royal, citing the safety of himself and his family. The High Court ruling made public elements of Harry's case, including his worries for his family when coming back to Britain. The majority of the legal matters related to this case, which discussed security plans for high-ranking individuals, were privately held in December. The verdict was delivered by retired High Court Judge Sir Peter Lane on Wednesday morning. In the final verdict, Retired High Court Judge Sir Peter Lane denied Harry's pleas and judged Rivek's approach neither irrational nor procedurally unfair. According to Sir Peter, Harry's lawyers pursued an inappropriate, formalist interpretation of the Rivek process. It was stated by Harry's lawyers that he felt singled out and treated less favorably by the institution. Shortly after the news broke, Harry announced that he intends to contest the decision.